Alright guys, so let me be showing you how to download PSP tool from the web and how to create and how to create a magic memory stick and or a Pandora battery. Uh, so the first thing you wanna do is open up your web page. I'm gonna be leaving this link at the description if in case you're too lazy and don't wanna search for it. So the thing you might you need to go to the PSP to <coughs> But even though once you are in this website, you need to subscribe or create an account. Uh, as you can see, I have done it already. Um, this is the PSP tool itself. So I just have found the PSP tool. So as you can see, uh. On this website, they give you instructions on how to create a magic memory stick. But if you're too lazy, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to create one. By the way, um, they also tell you that you need um, <coughs> an update, any kind. It has to be from one one point fifty, one point fifty, all the way to five point zero zero, and you have to download this this um any any of these for example if you want the version 5.00 m33 you need to download this one <coughs> as you can see the update requires well it's in spanish but um this thing uh, let me see if i can't oh, no i can't uh, the PSP tool. Oh, it's in Spanish, but I'm gonna translate it to you. The PSP, the PSP tool requires an update 5.0 in order to put 5.00 M33. Um, that's about it. And it comes with different versions. As you can see, it comes Despertar version 4, Despertar version 5, uh, version 7, and version 8. Um, it depends on what um, version that you want you want your PSP to to be. For example, in the version 5.00, uh, it needs to be on the version 8. Well, that's about it. Um, by the way, I think you you can download. You might want to download the update. Um, I'm gonna leave the post the the link for the updates at the description too. So for right now, I'm gonna just download this. Um, well, I'm not gonna download it because I already have it installed in my PSP. So it's just the same, but I'm gonna make a quick video on how to install it to your PSP. It's just like a regular homebrew, um, homebrew app or whatever. So in this case, the reason you have to register or make an account is because this thing only allows members to download uh, doesn't allow any uh, any other kind of visitor or I don't know to download you have to be a member to make a download so I'm gonna be downloading this one I'm gonna be downloading it so you can see how to so is your choice right here you might want to open it or save it as me I already have it so I'm gonna be opening it Open it and I'll put OK. As you can see, already PSP2 version 1, CP can start to fucking shit. It's downloading and it's supposed to be a competitor. So oh, I'm gonna go get my PSP. As you can see, my computer has finished downloading the PSP tool. I'm gonna be extracting it at my description. Uh, a tip, guys. Um, 
Yeah, this is a tip. You just might want to extract it to your desktop so you don't have to be searching for it. But if you can go extract it, whatever you want. As you can see, I have already extract my. I'm gonna be closing this. I don't need it no more. So. Once you have extract your files, by the way, she's really cute. Um, uh, the files count. Um, so once you have extract the files, this file is supposed to come out on the PSP, change log, document, and leave me. What the fuck is that? Oh, leave me. Um, read me. This is a read me text, but this comes in Spanish because you know I told you before I'm in Mexico, so everything comes in Spanish. Um, just for the extractions, nah, not everything. But as you can see, uh, I'm be Once you have, uh, I'm gonna show you guys that I, I already have it, but I'm gonna be installing the PSP2 again. I'm gonna erase this. As you can see, I already have. It. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you guys that I already have it. There you go. That I already have it, but I'm gonna be deleting it. So I can show you guys how to make, how to install. As you can see, delete complete. So I'm gonna be sharing this one now. As you can see, I am the 5.50 version. Uh, I have another video and uh, that I where I show you how to upgrade update from version M33 to Gen D3. And as you can see, I'm in version 5.50 Gen D3, and that's about it. Oh, you just saw my down. Oh well. Um, so that's about it. Oh no, you didn't. So I'm gonna be. USB mode. Oh. Oh. I'm gonna be closing this because this will not work anymore. So as you can see, do you want to scan and fix Modesto? No, I don't wanna. It never work. Oh. So once it has the aeroplane has start, you just might wanna go. Oh, this is the. My bad. So this is the update that I was telling you about. Uh, once you have downloaded them, you need to rename them to 500.bp, or if you want to download this one, the 5.50 pvp. But it doesn't really matter, cause uh, well, in the 5.50 pvp update, um, where I show you, it comes itself with a hack, so there's no need. There's no need in there, cause you're not. You are not gonna be hacking your PSP with a Pandora or Magic Memory Stick. It's just a homebrew. I'm gonna be showing you that later. Cause uh, right now I'm gonna be installing the PSP tool. So you just might wanna <coughs> uh, drag and drop your PSP folder that you have that you just downloaded. And wanna paste it on the on your the root of your memory stick. Say yes to everything that comes out. As you can see, my PSP tool it has been created. So I'm gonna be showing you guys. So you sign. <coughs> so I show you how I deleted my PSP tool. So as that's everything that you have to do. Uh, so I'm gonna be playing with this. Hold on. As you can see, my remote light has come back alive. And there 
you have it. As you can see, I have the PSP2 again. And I'm not going to be playing it because my remote line, for some reason, it keeps saying that in order to work, you need to. I don't know what the fuck. So I'm going to be pressing in it, but you're going to see that it's not going to work because I am in the remote light but once I have it <coughs> once I have it unplugged do you see? it's not gonna work, it's just gonna start in black no, I'm black black so there you go please disable the fun and plugins games mode to reduce the risk of issues recent arising how are after exiting so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be holding R because I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be making my memory stick right now. But uh, later on I'm gonna be showing you guys is the video after this one. You have to make it it's gonna be continu the continuation. I'm gonna be, be posting the link in the description too as soon as I make it. So there's gonna be three links in the description. One is for the PSP two, another one is for the P um for the updates, depending on which one you want, I'm gonna be posting the, the three of them. Um, I will just be posting the 5.00 version and the 4.00 version. But at this side uh, and this link that I'm gonna give you, you can find any update that you want. And that's about it. So thanks for watching and subscribe. And by the way, um, just if you, in case you have, if you see my other video, just you know, ignore it. I'm gonna be pasting the link right there so they can send you to this video.